coughing and runny nose. Combined, these symptoms can keep you in bed, but health experts say instead, people are coming to Lee Memorial Health System Convenient Care. Oftentimes, upper respiratory infections are viral in nature, and they simply just don't need antibiotic coverage to take care of them. But he says that doesn't mean patients won't ask. And when they have these things, they go, well, I have a sinus infection. I'm not doing well. I need antibiotics. And we say, well, you know, if we take a step back and look at what you really went through, you're having just bad allergies. In that case, he says it's better to treat the individual's symptoms instead of prescribing an antibiotic. Oftentimes, we want to make sure that you're getting antibiotics for proper conditions and not just because you know, you're feeling ill. But he says there are times when antibiotics are needed in cases like pneumonia, bronchitis, urinary tract infections, or strep throat. If your body gets used to getting antibiotics every time you get a little ill, it's going to, you know, expect that to happen. And then there's no motivation for your body to create, you know, an oh, antibiotic yeah. library or like a bacteria library where it knows to say, hey, this I've seen this bacteria before. We can just take care of this really easily. He says antibiotics can't tell the difference between good and bad bacteria, so it attacks both. Taking antibiotics too often can actually cause infections in your body. Instead of taking an antibiotic, we can oftentimes give you, you know, stronger prescription cough syrups and stronger anti-inflammatory medications, which make you feel quite a bit better a lot faster faster healing without antibiotics. For Lee Memorial Health System, I'm Lindsay Fry.